you already know how to tie rotors knot so we'll just demonstrate how to use your assistant effectively so this is extra corporal knot tying or rotors knot around a tubular structure so that's your needle end of the thread and this is the tail end we put a clip at the tail end and we just leave it on the side so that you know it's the tail end you pass it in pass it around the tubular structure you want to tie And it'll come out through the same port. We've already left this on the right, and now as it comes out, keep it in the neutral position. Now get your assistant to put the thumb in the middle. Okay? So the idea is the thumb is covering the port from top to bottom, 12 o'clock to 6 o'clock, so that he or she is not in your way. Separating the two limbs, right, left, and preventing any CO2 leak. Just loosen up a bit so that I can get a bit more length. Okay. So once you have decided what length you want outside, now we know this is the tail. This was the needle. We use the tail for tying the knot. So I need to just shift it to the needle end. So now I'll remind myself the clip is on the needle end. We'll tie our first square knot, holding the clip in your hand so you know this is the needle <coughs> end. Okay? And now this end is short. So rather than struggling, have your assistant ready with a second clip. So each time you throw, your assistant will pick it up from bottom. So two 360 degree circle. There we go. The so first one. Second throw. And now the third is sort of half throw. This time your assistant will come from the top to pick it up from here. From the top. It is coming from, from the top. Yeah, pick it up. Yeah, so it's from the bottom. Okay. Right from the top. It. It's coming here. Can you just sort of let's start again? So now the half throw. The assistant comes from the top and picks it up. Okay. Tighten the knot. Cut the tail to just about half an inch or an inch so that you know this is your tail and the two ends don't get mixed up you're still keeping the two limbs separate unlock if you think it's not sliding and now this end you can release Use your, your hand, fenestrated your hand. Okay, now your finger can come out. Slide it in position. Once you've reached, you come out. Take it out of the instrument eye. And then go back again, you hold it, give it to the assistant, go in again, pick up the two ends to lock it, and then you can cut it. Okay, 
stop Mario.